Hello guys, welcome to online web tutor presented by Perfotic Solutions team. I am Sanjay. We are learning WordPress custom post tutorial for beginners and this is our part 12. In this video session guys, we will discuss that how can we make main use of plugin as a custom post type. And also guys, if you are a beginner to this channel then please don't forget to subscribe and keep watching our previous video sessions to get the clear concept about WordPress custom post type tutorial. So basically guys from our previous video sessions we learned that how can we make our custom post type as well as we have seen more about things in custom post type. Okay, so what actually we are going to do in this video session. In this video session guys we will make a separate plugin in which we will register a menu. Okay, where actually we bind some of the custom post type to that menu as a sub menus. Right now as we can see that this is a menu pages where all pages and add new are sub menus and also you can see that in the post section these are all sub menus. Okay, so we are going to make a menu system and now inside this menu system all these sub menus actually are the custom post types. And also guys before going to that session actually we did a mistake in our last video session and what was the mistake if I go to our custom post type suppose movies in this movie section actually by adding on movie section we actually take in the details of producer like name and the email which is basically related to our movie system okay but when we actually click on all movies we can see that publisher email and the publisher name which is somewhere related with the books these are actually the same details which actually we have taken from by adding these movies but the naming convention according this is called something called producer email and the producer name okay this is actually one of the user has noticed of our users list and tell us that actually we have merged the concept of movie and the book system both okay because publisher is somewhere the is the term which is related with the book but the producer producer naming convention is somewhere with the movies okay so just change the name system so now we are going to make a separate plugin by the help of that plugin we will make sub menus as a custom post type okay so just back to editor and now this is the plugin guys that we have made so far okay so just I'm going to click on sources file click on folder and let's create a plugin called WP custom post type menus okay this is the folder that we have created and also we can check inside our folder that we have created right here okay this is inside the plugins folder so just back to editor and now inside this folder we are going to create a main plugin file suppose let's create a file and that file actually PHP file let's say that WP CPT menus.php so just go inside that file and now I'm going to copy some of the comment section from our last plugin. So this is the comment section that we have made. So just I'm going to copy and paste inside this PHP file. Okay. So let's change that to menus. And this is this is a simple plugin for menus and submenu system. Okay, so version should be something 1.0.0 and the author should be online web tutor. Okay, so let's make a function called function WPL or WT. Let's say CPT menus. This is the function we are going to define to attach our menus. Okay, inside this function, guys, we are going to use a WordPress function called add menu page. Okay, basically, this is a WordPress function which basically makes a menu. Okay, first we have to pass the page title. So let's say that. So before defining this plugin guys, why not actually we make uninstall the previous plugin, okay? So just I'm going to plugin section and now this is the plugin that we have made. So we want to be deactivate first. So just deactivate that, go to editor and let's make add menu page and something called movies, okay? This time it is a menu page, okay? Just I'm going to copy. Second parameter we need to pass called the menu title, third called the permission label so that is in this case let's say manage options fourth parameter we need to pass the page slug okay so let's say that movies fifth we need to pass called the callback function so we do not want to actually connect this menu system with any callback function right now we have no function to attach with this okay so let's pass false value because we don't want to pass any of the callback function with this menu okay next parameter we need to pass an icon for that okay so for icon just i have opened a website called dash icons sorry developers.wordpress.org slash resource slash dash icons okay inside this dash icons 
you can find several of the icons actually WordPress provides okay so let's make an icon something like that just I'm going to copy let's say dash icons image filter going to editor and now I'm going to paste inside this double quotes okay so this is the icon that we have attached with this menu system and finally after making this function we need to attach this function with our action hook called add action and this is called admin menu and this is the callback function that we have supplied okay so if we save this file go to browser administrator panel refresh this page and now this is the plugin that we have made just I'm going to click on activate button by activating guys as we can see that inside our menu system here is the menu called movies okay so when we click that page not found why because we didn't actually attach any of the callback function with this click just reload this page again and this is the menu so next what we have to do we have to attach some of the custom post types that we actually create and now we will bind inside this movie section okay so as we know guys that the from our previous video sessions we have a concept that how can we register a custom post type okay so basically WordPress provides a function called register post type which is responsible to register any of the custom post type in our WordPress setup okay so let's have a look this is the official website of WordPress which basically tells that how can we register a custom post type okay so just I'm going to scroll and now it provides some of the actually dummy data that we can use in this video session okay so this is the dummy actually this is the sample actually WordPress provides okay so let's I'm going to copy all these concepts okay this is a book custom post type that WordPress provides as sample data okay so just I'm going to copy go inside our plugin and now I'm going to paste it that let's replace some of the values some of the static values from this so first of all we have to change the name of the function okay so let's say that WPL or WT CPT and let's say that producer or let's say that movie categories okay movie category so this is the callback function just I'm going to copy and paste it here so before going to that if I copy this function copy that go inside editor and let's paste that first of all we have to actually replace all the terms with books let's say movie category okay so just I'm going to copy control H to replace and let's say that category okay so this is instead of book we are going to use called category okay so just I'm going to replace all so successfully we have replaced all the things okay and also for the category section actually we have to rename again so let's say the category it's not categories it's categories okay so just I'm going to replace all so successfully if I'm going to copy this content again go to our editor and replace with these contents okay so successfully we have made a custom post drive with the name of category okay so let's make in a small case so successfully guys this is the custom post drive that we are going to attach with this menu system okay so now question is that how can we attach this custom post drive with this movie section okay so before attaching that if you go to administrator panel just refresh that page so as we can see that the category is separate a menu system in this left sidebar so we want that these category system will be appeared inside this movie section not going to make any of the separate menu section so how can we achieve that so going just go to documentation of register post type let's find a term called so in menu okay so this is the term actually registration of custom post type contains okay so just I'm going to enter enter and enter so as we can see that in the args parameter it is an array and now inside this array we have passed a parameter called so in menu and basically so in menu takes three parameters first either it should be contain the true value or it will be false value and third it will be any string either it's a custom post type name or any of the page name okay so just going to editor and now let's find so in menu so basically this is so in menu and right now it contains the true value let's change it to the menu system that we have registered okay so this is the menu that we have registered okay so we want that we actually want to appear this custom force type inside that menu okay so we want that here we have to pass the menu slug okay so what actually menu slug we have provided movies okay so just I'm going to copy scroll down and now let's say that so in menu instead of this true value we have to pass the menu slug 
okay this is the menu slug that we have registered before that so if I save this file go to administrator panel and refresh that page once we refresh as we can see that inside movie section we have a sub menu called all categories so if I click that and this is a custom post app that we have registered so far in this plugin okay so what actually next we want we want that another custom post type will be registered with the name of called movies okay so inside this menu section guys we actually develop all the system by the help of custom post type and the menu of WordPress okay so basically inside this menu section that is movies inside that we want that add new or movie system will be there and add new category system will be there okay so just back to editor let's make copy of all these things means the custom post type things okay I'm going to I have copied just I'm going to remove all these and paste it here okay so all we have to remove the category name with the movie system okay so let's say that instead of category or let's say categories we have to replace so let's say that instead of categories we want that movies okay just I'm going to replace all so successfully we have replaced that and in place of category we want that it should be movies okay instead of categories we want movie so just I'm going to replace all so successfully we have replaced the categories and the movie by our new naming convention okay and here should be something called movie so let's copy all these contents go to editor and now inside that we are going to paste it here okay so before that why not actually we are going to make a comment for that so this is basically for the category section okay just scroll down and next we are going to register our movies okay so let's see that for custom post type movies okay just paste it here so successfully we have pasted all the register post type required contains for the movie section and the for category section okay so same in this so in menus we actually replace with the movie system movies this is the menu slug we want that this custom post type should also appear inside our movies menu page okay so just I'm going to cut this section and paste at the upper position before category okay because we want that, that this movie section will be appeared before category so once we just do it reload this page and now as we can see that inside this movie section inside this movie section we have two portions of custom post type first all movies and second all categories so inside all movies section we can actually add all movies and these all our movies actually came from our database where actually we have registered movie as a custom post type before so just I'm going to delete all these movies that we have created so far from our previous plugin okay so move to trash and apply so successfully if I go to trash just some check on and let's say delete permanently and apply okay so successfully actually we have removed all of our movies post type from this list so successfully in our movies case there is no movies that we have created there is no categories we have created okay so from our next video session guys we will see that how can we create our movies and categories from here and also inside this movie while creating any movie we want that this category appear right here so we will actually make that concept by the help of a meta box we will register a meta box where actually we have to choose some of the categories that we are going to create for this movie so basically guys from the help of this video session we actually learned about that how can we create a plugin by the help of custom post type because we have registered a menus name movie and now we have registered two post type that is categories and movie and we have taken the same menu that we have created as the menu slug and we have checked that so in menu of registered post type okay and actually we have seen that how can we show all these post types inside our custom menu that we have registered in this plugin okay so I hope guys that I have actually made the clear concept about registration of menus and custom post types inside that menu okay so if you have any query in this video session guys then please drop your comment I will give my reply as soon as possible so for this video session guys thank you for watching have a great day